Welcome to my job ad analysis with Voyant. I'm Sabrina Gillow. I searched for school librarian postings because that is the job I would like in the future. First, I browsed local school districts for school librarian job postings for the area where I would like to work. I searched the term school librarian. After I collected information from the job postings for Richardson ISD, Garland ISD, Grapevine Colleyville ISD, and Irving ISD, I moved on to the Texas Library Association's job listings since I am interested in staying in Texas. I collected information by recording it in a Word document to use as a corpus in Voyant. I analyzed the data by looking for frequency of key terms that I expected to find in job postings for this position, such as certification, masters, and teaching. I chose Cirrus, the word cloud, for the job overview because it is a great snapshot of the important aspects of the job postings I found. I also used trend graphs throughout the presentation because of the efficient way that they show frequencies of terms. I used tables to display comprehensive information that needed additional context beyond usage and frequency. I used Dreamscape and a bar graph to compare the geographic locations of the job postings that I found and to compare the salaries by location in Texas. School Librarian Description The school librarian is an instructional leader who will guide students in the use of library materials and resources. The school librarian will work with individuals, groups, and classes of students in order to create lessons that utilize library materials and resources, which support classroom and state standards, as well as encourage inquiry thinking, growth, and literacy skills. The school librarian will instruct students in the use of media resources and provide opportunities for students to practice using media for academic purposes. The school librarian will participate in the school community by providing curriculum and literacy support. For the position overview, this is the important information that I found about school librarians. The school librarian is an instructional leader responsible for creating a productive, safe learning environment with a variety of tools and resources for students and staff to utilize for literacy and academic purposes. The education requirements for a school librarian are a master's degree and one district cited an MLS preferred. The experience for a school librarian is a minimum of two years of classroom teaching, although school districts may prefer more. The knowledge, skills, and abilities that can be summarized for a school librarian are that they should be adept with technology, they should have organizational and communication skills, they should have knowledge of classroom instruction and curriculum, and they should be trained in school librarianship. The salary range for the school librarian is between $55,000 and $60,000 starting, depending on location and experience. The qualifications for a school librarian are a master's degree from an accredited university and library science program and the Texas School Librarian Certification. Almost all of the job descriptions specifically cited the master's degree. One cited an MLS preferred and all of them asked for a school librarian certification. The school librarian's job duties include providing information, services, learning opportunities, creativity, innovation, reading support, and leadership for students and staff at their campus. The school librarian must develop a culture of literacy through their services and support and provide instruction for the school librarian and media center. They should also foster and supervise a safe environment that is attractive to students and one in which classes, groups, and individual instruction and learning can take place. The school librarian must provide leadership and inform information for learning resources, not only for students, but also for staff on their campuses. The school librarian must be equitable in the resources, instruction, and services that they provide on their campus and in their library. The knowledge expected of a school librarian includes instructional design, training in library and information science, student behavior and management, knowing the best practices in school libraries, and knowledge of the school library media program. This knowledge can be summarized as the school librarian needing to have knowledge of both a teacher and a librarian and knowing how to effectively communicate that knowledge to their students and staff. The skills include having highly developed technology skills, organization, communication, interpersonal skills, being a proven leader, and having instructional skills. 
Communication is listed several times between knowledge and skills, meaning that it is one of the most essential tools of a librarian's toolkit. There are many abilities that a school librarian must have, including being able to identify, understand, and solve complex problems and provide solutions, organizing and prioritizing schedules, making decisions and evaluating their impact both long-term and short-term, providing instruction in varied settings, providing guidance for print and electronic resources, providing guidance in research tools and strategies, and working with and communicating with parents in the school community. They must also be able to work with data and serve as a teacher and instructional specialist. The preferred qualifications for a school librarian include experience with developing curriculum and instruction, as one district identified, experience specifically in a public school setting, as identified by one school district, elementary education experience, as identified one school district, which was specifically asking for an elementary school librarian, experience in reading and specialization certification, as required by one school district, and an MLS specifically mentioned as a preference and qualification as mentioned by one school district. The previous experience was somewhat consistent. Six of 10 job postings required two years of classroom teaching experience. One posting required three years of teaching experience and one required five years of teaching experience. Two of them specifically required training in school librarianship one preferred experience in a school library setting, and one preferred reading specialization experience. Overall, what this trend suggests is that in order to become a school librarian, you must have at minimum two years of classroom teaching experience, although more is desired, and you must have some training in school librarianship, and it would be best if you had some experience in literacy or in a school library setting. The geographic locations that I looked at included the DFW and North Texas area. I looked at the cities of Colleyville, Garland, Irving, and Richardson. I also looked at San Angelo, which is in the Hill Country that's around Central Texas. I also looked at the Austin area at some of the smaller suburbs outside of the major city, including Cedar Park, DeVale, and Pflugerville. These were actually so small, they almost don't show up on the map. And I also looked outside the Houston area, which these are some suburbs of that area, a leaf and spring branch. For salaries, I chose a bar graph to illustrate what I found in the school library postings. The salaries shown here do not consider any additional compensation for qualifications, such as a hiring stipend or bilingual stipend, and all assume that the employee being hired has a master's degree. All salaries shown assume zero years of experience, as the range in salary do depend on years of experience. For the DFW area, I found that they generally paid around the same amount, the lowest being Colleyville and Grapevine with 55,680, and the highest being Irving with 58,809. Richardson ISD fell right in the middle of the two. The Hill Country paid the lowest San Angelo ISD with almost $50,000 in salary a year. The Austin area was just a little lower than the DFW area, with its lowest being $52,540,000 a year, and the highest being $56,000 a year. The Houston area did pay more than the DFW area, with its lowest being a leaf that I found at $60,000 a year and comparing it against Spring Branch, which paid almost $63,000 a year. What this graph illustrates is that there is a little over a $10,000 difference depending on the area in Texas where you teach among the school districts that I researched. But while that is drastic, of the school districts I researched, it was generally pretty close in the amount that they compensated their employees. Some trends in school librarianship that I noticed is that experience or the ability to teach appeared in every job posting. The ability to work with and develop library materials and resources also appeared in every job posting. And every posting included requirements for working with students. Each job posting required a certification from the state of Texas for school librarianship 
and most job postings included descriptions for working with media. I picked using the word berry to illustrate this because I thought it was a great succinct way to show what some of the most important concepts were to be pulled out of these trends. For example, when I look at it, I specifically notice media, I specifically notice curriculum, I specifically notice literacy. These are all very important. Of course, students is in there as that is where the focus of school librarianship is according to the job descriptions that I found. For these school districts, I had to search their web pages for their compensation scales. Many of them compensate their school librarians by the teacher pay scales, and those were not listed in the job postings. Instead, the job postings used language such as by teacher pay scale. As such, I have referenced the scales here since this information was not in the job postings themselves. The school districts that I had to reference for this reason were Grapevine and Colleyville, Irving, Leander ISD, Richardson, and San Angelo. Finally, I'd like to acknowledge Buoyant by Mr. Sinclair and Mr. Rockwell. This software was helpful in understanding the data that I pulled from the school librarian job postings and helping create the illustrations for the charts and graphs that were used in this presentation. Thank you for providing us with this software.